Lou, how did walk through number one go for you? Went well, went well, just, you know, getting the plays down and just having fun, just flying around, not flying around and walk through, but, you know, just getting ready for that practice this afternoon. Is is the stuff, uh, terminology, you know, how they call it, is it similar to what you've had in the past or no? Uh, some stuff, but, you know, it's really just come down to learning the language, getting comfortable and just building those good habits and just getting the reps under my belt. Are you uh, joining a team, Aaron Jones, A.J. Dillon? I mean, are you, how do you look at that? Man, that's exciting. You know, those guys are, have already reached out to me and, um, you know, just trying to take me under their wing. So that's exciting just to get in a room with those guys, get coached up by those guys and see how they, you know, move as professionals. So that's definitely exciting. Lou, how, how is it? I mean, this is kind of a, a historic type place. <laughs> how did yes. it feel walking into the Man, it was it, it was just a blessing, you know, just this opportunity in front of me. Like you said, such a historic um, team like this. It, it was just a blessing, you know, just to get the opportunity to help this team win games. It's, it's just a blessing, to say the least. What's your first impression? Ben Sherman's a good coach. Yes, sir. Uh, yeah, you, you kind of strike a, hey, this guy knows his stuff when you got in the meeting room. Uh, yes, definitely. Definitely just, you know, seeing him, you know, uh, go over the film and go over the plays, you definitely – um, I definitely felt that vibe. Yeah, he definitely knows what he's talking about. Central Michigan connections to Matt LaFleur. Have they paid any early dividends? Has he, uh, has he been talking chipless with you at all? Uh, a little bit, not too much. Just a, just a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> what, are you, what are you hoping to get done over these next couple of days? Really just learn, you know, um, learn from all the guys that, that are already here, you know, build a bond with the rookies. Um, compete, you know, put good stuff on film and have fun doing it. Like you said, it's a historic franchise, so got to have fun doing it and uh, really just compete and learn all of that just in one. You have, the same, you have the same running back coach as, as Aaron Jones. Correct? Yes. I mean, to already know that going in, was there an instant connection with you two? Have you reached out or anything like that? Yes, I talked to him yesterday and we kind of just, you know, just touched bases on, you know, like you said, we had the same running back coach, so, you know, I've my years in college, we always watched his um, his college film because we ran similar plays at Central. So just, you know, meeting him yesterday was kind of a surreal moment. Just, you know, pick his brain a little bit. But that's definitely just a, a blessing just to have that connection. And I know you want to have confidence coming into this, but knowing that someone like that has had that success, and like you said, running the same plays, having the same coach, do you feel like maybe that's a little more confidence with you coming in here? Yes. All that stuff you have to take under your belt and just, you know, use to your advantage. So we had the same coach. You know, we ran similar plays. and. You know, he's had very much success in the league. So for me to um, follow his footsteps, that would be awesome. Now, don't tell him I said this, but I think you're just a little bit taller than him. Do, do, you, <laughs> do, do you feel like going into this, it's going to be really fun to compete and to learn under him? Definitely, definitely. You said it best. Just compete, learn from him, and have fun doing it. So, yes. Now, now you're, set, oh, go ahead. Go ahead, you're new to Packer fans. Uh, could you describe what's your running style all about? Uh, I believe I can, you know, do everything, you know, run between the tackles, run downhill, catch out the backfield, and um, really just anything that the coaches ask me to do. You know, I feel as though if I'm not as good as it, as good at what they're asking me to do, I'll just work on it, continue to craft at it, and um, I just feel like I'm an all-around back. Have you heard that blitz pickup is a big deal in the NFL? <laughs> and especially it's been a big deal here for a long time. Definitely, definitely. Um, Protection, protecting the quarterback has always been a, a big deal since I first started playing football. And definitely when you, once you get to college and the NFL, it's even more big of a deal because everything starts with the quarterback. So definitely have to protect him. Lou, uh, do you get the sense that once you get here, whatever round you're picked in, whatever number you're picked, it kind of goes out the window and it's so wide? Um, yes, it definitely goes out the window because at the end of the day, we're all here now. And uh, the stuff that you put on film is what you're going to get judged by. So. Um, what rounds you get picked, it doesn't it doesn't matter. Um, so whatever you put on film, that is your resume. That's what matters most more than anything.